those of you wondering what is on my hands, I am wearing compression gloves because I have dodgy wrists. Anyway, we are talking about Monster X The Dreaming. This is the ninth studio album and their second full length album in English. Oh, you don't get many K pop groups that will do these like English albums, and well, Monster X, they didn't disappoint with the first one, and so I was all for this. There are four like volumes in like the deluxe like album. I've got volume four. I chose it because I love like the black and like the purple and the blue. There were some like lighter colours on earlier volumes, but I was like, you know what, no, this is dark like my soul. Let's just, you know, open it up because that's what people are curious about. We have goodies. We'll end with the goodies and we'll start with are we missing the point or is it the dreaming? That sounds like a quote from a horror film. Anyway, you get this lovely, lovely, oh, photo book. I would love if a lot more like Western groups did this, you know, yeah, because you get to see the members, everyone has their favourites and yeah, I really like this because it shows a different side. I'm not going to show all the photos because, well, that would be cheating and some of you might just snap them up. But yeah, it's simple. I like the fact that this is actually also like holds the CD at the back. You've got the titles on the back. So it's like a book with like a sleeve. And now we get on to the goodies. Let me move this over here. We have the lyric book. Very nice, very nice. Well, quite a few albums do this. I'm seeing this a lot. I know there is a poster. I have a feeling it might be this one. There's that. We have photo cards. You get two, I want to say, in each volume. Very nice, very nice indeed. They will go in a collection. I say that these are my first two like photo cards for Monster X. I'm learning that about K-pop is with these albums is photo cards. It's like Pokemon, you just gotta catch them all. Moving on, photo cards aside, you have stickers. That's very nice, I like that. You can stick them on things. I used to stick um, stickers on the back of my laptop, but I stopped doing that in recent times. Maybe I should like put like K-pop stickers on my new laptop. Leave a comment down below if you'd like that. And now the poster. I recognise that shot. We've seen it in the book. We've seen it. I'm going to open this upside down. And you get, let's put it down here, a lovely group poster. That will look nice on a wall. Don't know if I'm going to put it on the wall because right now I currently don't have anywhere to put it. But I love this. Love this shot. Oh, Monster X. Like, there is no denying that, you know, this is a good looking band and I'm going to hold my hands up now and say that is real. So I actually believe this was really good value. Let me fold this back up. I don't know what conversion price is in, like, Europe or the rest of, like, well, the world, but I paid $19.99 for this at HMV, which is a music shop here in England, and I thought really good value for money. I have paid a lot more for some of these like K-pop albums which you'll see in future videos. But yeah, so you get the book, the photo book, the CD, you get a poster, a nice size poster, you get some stickers, you get some photo cards, and you get a lyric book. Which, sorry for knocking that, is very good value for well the money and it's probably one of the more affordable albums. For me, this is probably better than their first English language album. I just love every single song and Monster X continue to like put out songs album to album, single to single, comeback to comeback. They're all different but if you want to get into Monster X and maybe you don't want to start off listening to their Korean stuff, I highly recommend diving in to their English language album, especially The Dreaming. And that just wraps up my Monster X The Dreaming Volume 4 album unboxing showing whatever you call these on YouTube. 
So there we have it guys and girls the internet, that was just my first ever attempt at one of these like unboxing showing off a K-pop album. I hope you guys liked it. If you are fans of Monster X then you know tell me in the comments. If you're a fan of other K-pop groups then you know well the comments is the place to be. Some of you are going to be like but Beth you haven't reacted to this group on the channel. And that's because I knew Monster X before you guys started requesting K-pop groups. And, well, I would feel bad reacting to a group that I already know. But if you want to see me react to Monster X, like, newer stuff in the future, also, the comments is the place to go. Start a conversation. Everybody is entitled to their own opinion here on this channel. And trust me, a lot of you guys, I'm looking at you guys, are very opinionated when it comes to K-pop. Yeah, let's just wrap up this video before I continue to ramble. If you'd like to support me and the channel in the future, you can by clicking like to show me some love. You can click subscribe, you can tap that bell to be notified of when I upload on this channel. At the end of this video, you can check out my last two videos or playlists, depending on what mood I'm in when I'm editing this. Until next time, I'm Beth. Goodbye.